And this, uh, like I said, the equipment's a little bit uh, clumsy, but I've got to do this with one hand. And uh, poking myself is not one of my uh, ideas of a really good time. So, so I'm going to... Poking myself with a number 20 needle kind of freaks me out just a little bit. Um, and I also have to work the uh, vacuum with the hand that I'm poking. So, so I guess I'm a Pokemon today. So I'm just going to go ahead and uh, get this son of a over with. Uh, everybody says poke quickly. How the f*** do you poke yourself quickly with a gigantic needle? I guess uh, you just do it. Uh, it shouldn't be that bad. Well, it's not bad. I hope I'm in the right place. I uh, don't feel... I think I missed it. I'm going to pull it out and try again. i got to go straight in. That did it. Little vacuum going on here. That uh, pulled quite a bit of uh, fluid out. Not bad. I'm not going to go into the liposuction business or anything, but uh, uh, definitely, uh, definitely took the uh, bulk of the fluid off. I think I'll uh, call myself uh, done right now and quit while I'm ahead. I can uh, watch it for a couple days, and if I need uh, to remove some more fluid. I've uh, got extra needles, and that worked pretty darn good. I'm pretty pleased. At least I don't have major Popeye going on anymore. A little blood there, but uh, it uh, seems to have removed most of the fluid. That's good. There was a lot of buildup. Look at that. <laughs> that's kind of that's kind of slick. Got quite a bit out, and a lot, still a lot left in the uh, in the hose. No blood in it. It's just amber colored, which is the same color as it was when I went to the doctor. Well, it looks pretty successful. <laughs>